Hi everyone, we are here today in Vienna city center. We are in Lugek and let's go to Lapstede to see Ben. Come. Hey Alex, come on, show the place. My name is Ben Wallesi. I'm the head bartender of the restaurant Labstelle. Also the creator of the Red Beard Vienna Craft Beers. I'm 32 years old. I work in the gastronomy for about 15 years, but I started bartending in London exactly 10 years ago. Well, since the Labstelle got locked down, uh, we got busy producing takeaway stuff that people can order online and uh, enjoying them in their homes. For example, um, my classic, uh, which is the uh, grapefruit gin and tonic. For this I use the Bobby's gin and the Lebroni, which is basically our uh, own Negroni. I use the bitter liquor uh, from the professor. I don't really have favorite cocktails. I, what I want to drink always depends on my mood, on, on the season, the weather. But I, I usually, I, I mostly drink tiki cocktails and I like smoky ones or hot, spicy, spicy drinks. For example, uh, um, a mezcal sour will be always in my top five. The best cure for a hangover? I don't know. Probably not to get wasted. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> Yeah, no, the most important thing is uh, chug shitloads of water while you're doing your night out and you'll be fine. Next day you'll be all right. Um, well, if not, well, fuck it. Let's have a beer. <laughs> Best day to go out. It's the 17th of March, St. Patrick's Day. The weather is usually milder, it's perfect for uh, standing outside of a pub, having conversations to completely drunk strangers. I also brought you a drink for this occasion, called the Bevois. The Lebroni is basically just a classic Negroni. Um, for this drink I use the humble handcrafted uh, gin, which is an Austrian product, and Del Professore Vita Liqueur, uh, which is made by the famous bartender Leonardo Lucci, and my self-made vermouth, which is made by a famous bartender myself. This drink is called the Beauvoir, what I'm gonna make in an ISI flask with nitrogen. Starting off with 30 milliliters of the Peaky Blinders blended Irish whiskey. It's got beautiful sherry cask notes, harmonizing the mellowness of the other ingredients. So we put 30 milliliters in it. Then we put equal amount of hazelnuss liqueur of the Freihof. Couple of drops of uh, Old Spice bitters. Some lime juice for the freshness. A 
And last but not least, I'm gonna add 80 milliliters of my self-made smoked stout, which is called the Rauchfangkera. I'm gonna put 80 milliliters. And then we're gonna transfer this whole thing into the ISI flask. Into the nitro cartridge in. So guys, there you have it, the Pergola, made of Peaky Blinders, blended Irish whiskey, stout and other nice liquor.